Oh, what's going on, everybody? It's your boy, Galliman20, and we are back with Supermarket Simulator Mods. And today, I'm going to be showing you how to install the Real USA brands, every product remade, and the e commerce mod as well. Uh, so, one of you guys had a, a difficulty with installing this mod, or it just didn't show up for you. So, I'm going to go ahead and install it, see if I do anything wrong, and if it doesn't work for me, and we'll see how it plays out. So, got my mods right here. We're going to go to our other location right there. And then we're going to go Real Products USA. Go here. All products compressed. So we're going to go to BEP, INAEX. We're going to go to Plugins. Yep, Texture Replacer. And then... This one is going to be Object Textures. Now, I am going to get rid of the books because I don't know if it's going to do anything with those. I'm just going to do that for now. Uh, looks like we got a couple text documents in here. I don't know if they're supposed to be in this package or not. Let's see. I'm just going to click on one. Uh, so that is 91EF, okay. Usually that would be under names, because usually those are text files. Yeah, uh, so I'm confused why those are in here. Because if I click on this, okay, name, brand, okay, I don't know. People do things different. So we're just going to drop this down, delete this, go back into product icons, get rid of this. That way we're starting fresh. I guess I'm not going to question it. We're just going to throw it in there. If it doesn't work, it doesn't work. And then we'll figure out a way to fix it. But the guy supposedly told us we're supposed to throw it in object textures. Now we'll go to product icons, icons all the way down, bada bing, bada boom. And then product names. Okay, that is set in stone. We got all that put into the game. Now we're going to go to the e-commerce mod and I do remember looking at it it said we're supposed to put it in our mods folder which is in ML loader and it's about to get loud here I don't know if it's going to actually affect my talking or affect the background noise or anything that I'm doing. When my fan is turning on if it does bug you please let me know and I'll turn it off. It's not hot in here at all it's just that it kicks on after it gets to a certain limit. So e-commerce goes in there, we exit out, then we're going to exit out of all these tabs, and we're going to open up the game. We mods already active, so we got a supermarket simulator, and now I'm just going to open that up, there we go, cool. And let's see if it all works. So how's everybody's day going so far? It is Thursday afternoon. Thursday afternoon. Doesn't feel like a Thursday, it feels like a Friday. Come on. Let's go, Supermarket Simulator. Still waiting. <laughs> I don't know if you guys can see my mouse, but it's it's turning. 
Spinning. You good? <laughs> Mr. AC unit? <laughs> it like stopped for a second. I'm like, no. There we go. That's what we wanted. We wanted the loading screen. Okay, so we have to do a little bit of shifting around. The e-commerce section is right here. So we're going to put Mr. Cashier further down right next to this guy. Okay. And then yeah, we can put some pallets down there. Why not? Just put one in the middle. That way they can grab that if they need to and then check out. I know that's okay. I turned the AC unit off in the back. I got the other ones running. We're good. We're chilling. Okay. Uh, and then we got one on that side. We'll put another one on this side. That way it's kind of the flow of the toilet paper. There you go. Nicely done. So this is our e-commerce. We it's, Just think about Kroger Pickup or any other place that you go to pick up is the, I, that's what I'm describing it as even though it is shipping out to that specific uh, place I don't know so we're gonna pick the product and we ship it in this US mail and we make profit off of it just another way of doing business um, and then we now gotta go check our products and it looks like all of our products have worked. Because we got Snuggle, Tide, all these, Simple Green. And then, see, I figured it was going to change the books. That's why I didn't mess with the books. I just took out what I had and did that. I mean, I like it. I like it. Uh, so then we got Kibbles and Bits, Double Duty, Cat Food. The bread is throwing me off, but different, definitely different. Uh, let's see what cereal choices and chips that they do choose. Doritos, Tostitos, and Lay's. Nice. Mountain Dew and Coca-Cola. Fruity Pebbles. Cheerios and Cinnamon Toast Crunch. Nice. And, of course, you've got your regular peanut butter. Okay. Uh, Peter Pan peanut butter. Okay. Okay. That's different. And then Nutella, Sour Patch Kids. Yeah, that's that's nice. Um, I figured they had to do Jack Daniels for that one. If they didn't do Jack Daniels, I don't know. Kegs, Voodoo Ranger, Blue Moon, and Heineken. Gotcha. Okay. Now let me go down here. I want to see how this works. Is another tab that I have to go to? Supermarket online. Here we go. And I guess it happens once we open the store, but this is where we get our orders from, and then we go ahead and click on and I guess accept what we got to do. Uh, there's another mod that I was going to do. Let me quit the main menu, because remember I was going to do that and failed to do that. Uh, let me go to Nexus real quick. Nexus. 
And then last seven days, just to do that. No max order limit we're going to have to get rid of to acquire this mod, which should be an ML loader mods. No max order limit. Rest in peace. Because we want to get the mod where you can just click and it automatically restocks your shelves. Was that on the first page? No. I'm trying to figure out where I found that at. Do you guys remember? Maybe not might not be on here, it might be on the fourteen day one. Go back to page number one. Yep, refill storage. That's where it was. So let me go to files, download, fix negative items. I'm glad they fixed something before I downloaded it. I don't know how you can have negative items, but okay. Back to files. And this is going in ML loader. Cool. Get out of that. Go to new downloads. Refill. Get out of that. And let's go back into the game. Uh, also, next on my preview that I'm going to be doing, not today, but maybe later tonight, we'll see how things play out. Uh, Pet Shop Simulator is another one I'm going to be showcasing to you guys. So just stay tuned for and look out for a video or live stream, depending on what I do, uh, for that game. Okay, back to it. So now, you guys see shelves right here. Pretty bare, pretty bare. So now we're going to go to the computer. Refill all. And I exit back out of this. I don't know how long it takes to do this, but I, I just clicked the button. And if all went well, we should just be able to back out. Your cart was refilled with items you need. Oh. Okay, so then we go here, and then we click Purchase. Okay, so it refills it in the cart itself. Look at that. All restocked and ready to go. I love it. That's great. So it basically, it takes the over limit mod, combines it together, and makes it its own, which is great. Uh, now we need to open up the shop. Duh. So let's open it up. Let's get, there you go, it says new orders available. We're going to hit the play button 
for Wii Mod. And then we'll wait till 9 o'clock and press F5 in, uh, in order to accomplish that. Because we're going to be staying open 24 hours. <laughs> So now that the store is open, F5, go back here, go to our online shop, and look at all these that are rolling in. So $90, accept. So now we get a box, we cl right click to collect the items, and left click to post in the box to send the order. So they need one thing of General Mills. Oh my god, I think it crashed. Don't crash, please don't crash. Oh no, and now I'm getting a phone call on top of the game crashing. Son of a biscuit! <laughs> Okay, quick phone call. Uh, we're, we're still waiting for the game to load. Hey, this is what happens. Manuela, what's going on? Well, you did miss me installing the mod, but I did do it in the beginning, so you should be able to revert back to the beginning of the live stream to see me do it. And and then you can come back to the live portion of it. Alexa, set timer for one hour. One hour, starting now. Jojo wanted me to wake her up in an hour, so I had to set timer. But no, uh, you didn't miss anything. I've only been live for eighteen minutes. So yeah, you haven't missed a thing. It was just installing mods, getting the mods to work. Uh, the mods do work. And yeah, we're going from there. Uh, refill all. We'll just wait till it fills the cart. There we go. Purchase. If you want a block specific, you go there and press B. Okay, now we're going to go here, click save, that way we saved that portion that we just did. I mean, it's not it's not a big portion, but it's something. Uh, I also added the e-commerce uh, part of it, and uh, we're going to get the store open now. Uh, I forgot, I got to click on Mod again, since we exited out of the game. Real, what's going on? Okay, and it should be active now. We're gonna open our store. New orders are available. And we're gonna wait till it gets to about 845. Since we already got the mod running, I just gotta press F5. You didn't miss the live. Now we go back to the page, and let's do this one at the top. Uh, let's do the 107 one. Hot Pockets. 
Okay. I really got to pay attention to what we're doing now because... Uh, since the brand names have changed, <laughs> I got to figure out where they are in the racks. Hot Pockets. Cool. Uh, I'm assuming I got to get them from the actual sales floor. Hot Pockets. Okay. We need one. We need... I wish it would... See, now that's the only thing I see on there. It should cross it off the list once it's done. Like, put a line through it, just so I know I did it. Even though I know where I'm at. London Fog Tea. London Fog Tea. T T T T T. Huh. I don't know where the T's at. We're just going to have to pass that up. Uh, Cinnamon Toast Crunch. Oh, maybe it does. Maybe it does take it off the list. It doesn't put a line through it. It just completely takes it off the list. I like that. Uh, Eggland's Best 12-pack. Uh, there we go. Uh, premium Lager. That's going to be in the back. That should be... There we go. Um... Maybe it wasn't that one. Premium lager. Uh, did I get specific? I don't know why I'm just putting random stuff in here. Premium lager. Uh, huh. Whole wheat flour. Flour is going to be here. Okay. Bisquick. Uh, real? I quite a bit, quite a bit. Uh, when was the last time you were here? What do you remember? Bisquick. I like how I put in uh, Yuling Lager as an item that I don't need. So if you put an item that you don't need, it does a one tick on it. Uh, pasta, stuffed crust. So what is it? Okay, gotcha. Uh, so I added e-commerce today. I added restocking your shelves where I don't have to go through and scan everything. I still have the ability to scan, but uh, it refills my back stock automatically with whatever I have. Um, I, I don't think much has really changed mod-wise besides what I live-streamed yesterday. Okay, so that was the same day I did that, too. Nice. Okay, Spongebob bars. I like that. Definitely not in here. Hard-boiled eggs. I'm horrible. I'm horrible with this. Uh, maybe I should go back to where I knew what the product was. Red wine. Hello. Hello. I'm assuming it's got to be this one. It's the only thing that's red. Yep. Strawberry yogurt. Strawberry yogurt. Okay. Uh, orange juice. Okay. Did not want to do that. Sushi large. Okay. Potato puffs. I don't know what potato puffs are. Anybody know what potato puffs are? Fresh mozzarella. Okay. So we do need premium lagers still. That's, uh... 
I don't know where the tea's at. Do I have tea out here? I don't think I have tea out here. Oh, yeah, pallets. Yeah, pallets are a brand new one. Pallets are my favorite, actually. This is my shelving display. Very nice. Not legit, but very nice. Cheese stuffed crust pizza. De giorno. Perfect. Glad it's already out here. Rotini pasta. Rotini, rotini. Okay. Uh, da, 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 Bisquick. That should be in the next aisle. See, I see Nesquik. It's not the same thing. I should know this, but Bisquick. Where would Bisquick be, guys? Anybody? Trying to figure out where that would be in an actual store. Potato pops are in the freezer? Okay, good. This quick. Oh, it's on an end cap. Cool. I guess mine was originally moved to an end cap. Gotcha. Um, anything else? Hard boiled eggs. Hard boiled eggs. Okay, I guess that's where hard boiled eggs is at. Uh, potato puffs. And now I'm getting a phone call again. Yay!
Okay, ladies and gentlemen, I am back. I know I could press T. I completely forgot about that again. Okay, so now we got our... No. I want my Spongebob. There we go. So potato puffs might be a freezer item. There it is, potato puffs. That's why I bought the freezer. Because I needed to put more product out here. Again, I still don't know about the premium lager. That should have already been a get given. And the London Fog Tea. London Fog Tea is going to be somewhere in this vicinity. Stella Premium Lager. So, I know what it looks like now. So it's in the refrigerated section, and it's going to be one of these guys. Nope, it's definitely this one. There we go. Now we need the Harney and Sons London Fog Tea. Okay, where are you at? Um, and real... Um, I, I saw your comment where it says when your store is so big you don't even know where your stuff is anymore. I do know where my stuff is. It's just that I changed the products to be real U.S. American products. And uh, that kind of threw me off. That's that's the part that got me. I was not expecting to have to memorize all the products again. Some of these products are not even products that I even know. Like this one. I don't even know what that is. So we're still trying to find the London Fog Tea. Like I've never even heard of London Fog Tea. I've heard of just regular tea. But not by London. Let's see. Let's see what it looks like on the computer. Products. London. Oh, okay. Duh. I don't know why I was losing my brain on that one. It's an aisle four. Whatever. Well done. Click on post box to complete. Nice. Okay. That was that was a headache. And now we know where some of our products are. You want to continue your game and you accidentally click new game? Ah, uh, that's the worst. What we got? What we got? So we're going to do some small orders too. That way we can get those out of here. Oh, this is an easy one. Belgian white beer keg. And so this is Belgian white beer. Blumen. Oh, yeah. Blumen. Uh, long grain wild rice. It would be right it's by Ben's. Right here. Cool. I almost threw it in the trash. That would have been hilarious. Wizard Oz book. See, if they... I This is just me. They, they should put the products... Because that's I'm a visual person when it comes to that. Put the product name on the far left-hand side. I, re I read left to right. I don't write, read right to left. So when I see Wizard of Oz, yes, I know that's a book. but And I think we're out of the Wizard of Oz book, too. Please don't be out of the Wizard of Oz book. We need the book. Peter Pan. No. Uh, free delay Doritos. Wonka gift box. That would be an aisle one over here. Red cat, red wine. That should be this one right here. Blue moon beer keg. And then kiwi strawberry water. Okay. I got you. I can do that. 
Uh, kiwi strawberry water. Kiwi strawberry water. Oh, it's probably got to be this one. No. It's that one. Okay. So we're going to have to help these guys out real quick. Um, unless you have what I'm looking for, then I don't. No. Yeah, I'm gonna have to help him out. Wizard of Oz book. There it is. Oh, absolutely. I don't know why I just put it on the ground. See, glad I'm glad you guys give me suggestions on what to do. We can get these orders later. Shelving units, let's go. Uh, so we got three on the wall. Let's do four. Four might be a little overkill, but we'll see. I just know with more product, we're going to have to add more product to the back as well. There we go. I mean, it does look a lot like eh, a lot nicer now. There's no gaps. And how many books do we have in total? That looks ugly. Uh, two, four, six, eight, ten, twelve, twelve. So. One, two, three, four. I need to move this over just a smidge. I'm not going to lie. I do like it where you can freehand and put stuff where you want it. That's just me. Uh, let's, because I'm going to do two, four, six, eight, ten, twelve. Yeah, that's perfect. That's exactly the amount that I need. So two, four, six. So this is one. Four, four. That's only one, two, four, six, eight, two, four, six, eight, two, four. Okay. That works. No, no, no. Get rid of the tags. All goes well. <laughs> should be able to do this. As long as these people keep buying products, we should be able to do this no problem. I was about to say, is there a line all the way out here? No. <laughs> Just remember, these are all grouped together, these are all grouped together, and those are all grouped together. Uh, that first one is on the left. Yeah. Buy them, buy them, buy them. Why are you guys going over to the shelf? There's nothing on the shelf. And there goes my birdies. 
Talking, talking, talking. This is not the one. This one is that. You guys can probably hear him going crazy right now. And we're going to go like that. Peter Pan. Gosh, chill. Four. And then this one is one, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Perfect. Uh, this one is Wonderland. Yeah, we can do that one. That is, did I just put a one up there that wasn't supposed to go up there? Oh, there it is. It blended in. Put this one on the bottom shelf just to keep it color separated. Excuse me and my changing abilities. Just because we have two that have white. So I figured I'd go. I mean, it's kind of. Well, I forgot. This section right here is just. I mean, at least it has a different color to distinguish, but I don't know. You guys are just taking my books right off the shelf. Can't even get to it in time. Uh, did I put the yellow one up there yet? Yeah, so they're all up there. Now we move on to the other section. Hey, Gallon, have you ever done the garden live you talked about last time? So we went ahead and did not do the live, uh, but I will go ahead and show you progress. Not today, obviously. Um, tomorrow, because that will be three days since we last talked about it. They said between three and four days you should see sprouting. And... Well, hopefully we uh, see sprouting. There we go. Books are on the shelf. Now they just really just got to get restocked. So now we go to refill all. Go there. Purchase. Shelves are back and restocked. And uh, we're going to have to help these fellas out. Because our books are going like crazy. Unless I get the duplication mod and get more restockers.
I'll probably do a live because we got to switch locations of where it's currently at. I basically have a sunroom upstairs. That's what I'm at least considering it to be. And, I mean, I think it's doing pretty good. But I think it needs to change locations elsewhere. That way it gets a little bit more sun than what it is right now. I think it's only getting maybe five hours, and I think it needs a total of six, six plus. Right, right. Yeah, I don't know what it is about these stairs. They just don't like me. I always have to jump. Maybe, just maybe, I could do this. Let me just refill the shelves again. I forgot, we have an extra shelf out here. Uh, maybe we don't need it. I can put another freezer there, add more freezer units. But I was thinking about maybe extending the time so that way the store has to close. We can restock all the shelves and then get back into what we were doing with the e-commerce stuff. Uh, let's go to this, boom and boom. Okay, so we got SpongeBob, Potato Puffs, that, 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 and Oreos. Okay. That way I grab something that is not already out here. This is not already out here. Just want to verify it. I really don't want to do that because it's only one box and it goes very quickly. I think I can get one more box on there of these. It's only 12. And then we got to do the Spongebob one, restock that. Where you at, Spongebob? There you are. And the potato puffs. Pretty much everything in this freezer. No wonder these are popular, they're a dollar. Uh, and then Manuela, I just saw your other comment. I'm just kind of casually going up the list of comments. Uh, are the book are the new book covers in the USA mod, or are they downloaded from a different mod? Damn, guys, chill. Hold on. I don't know what the hell is going on. I mean, this is normal. This is how they, I mean, communicate throughout the day, every once in a while. But like. I'm just over here gaming, and then they start doing it again. Um, so the new book covers, yes. I took out the old book covers, which were the PS1 games, and I replaced it with what they gave me, uh, which was all these USA ones.
Okay, I moved them to face the window, so that way they can look outside. In the morning, I can't really do that because the sun will literally be right in their face. But now it's like 6 o'clock, so they're, they're good. We're not going to do any more orders for the online part of it. We're just going to wait till the store closes at 9. And it uh, looks like most of our shelves are getting pretty bare. This chemical aisle is always bare. <laughs> but like I told you guys, I will be expanding and now I'm getting a phone call. I'm not answering. I'm done. I'm done answering the phone today. You guys are going to just have to deal with it. I'm talking about the people that are calling me. No more. Gallon man, no more. Uh, I should probably turn some lights on. Light switch. I am lagging a little bit. That's all good. We're going to save the game right here. Remember, you guys know this. It gets laggy when it gets nighttime. That's why I try not to make it nighttime. At all. You can stand right here and it's like. It gets better. Oh, look at this. They're even. Like, waiting to go inside the store. I guess there's like a limit of people who can go inside the store or something. I don't know. But yes, remember, when we do this, let me hurry up and stock up the back of the warehouse before it gets to 9 o'clock. So that way everything can get stocked up once 9 o'clock rolls in, which will be in 10 seconds. Perfect. End of day. Click enter. Oh, perfect. It didn't, it didn't lag out this time, guys. Let's go. Progress. Start next day. Everything but this one was filled up. That is the Cascade. So we're going to need more Cascade products in the back so that we can fill up the pallet. And these are on sale, it looks like. I'm going to take that off a of sale price. Looking good, looking good. Books are looking clean. Yes, sir. Uh, Cascade is down this way. And then we'll just go back to refilling it. Rip. Okay, back room is now filled after they just restocked everything. Books and that dog food back wall. Let's check the back wall. Okay. Yeah, like I said, need more cascade in the back. Don't know where I'm going to put it in the back. Uh, maybe I can put it right here on this other rack. Cascade. Don't even have any in the back at all. They just took it all. So we'll do six. So it looks like it's one big box. And how many are in it? I think it's eight. Eight to a box. Not enough. Especially to fill that pallet out there. Mm -hmm. 
So another mod, if you guys mod creators are watching, I threw this suggestion out the other day when I was playing. But what if we were to have backstock storage on pallets, but those pallets are able to fill our product on the floor? So like right here. They're having to take the product from my shelving unit, you see over there, and filling it on my pallet. But what if we take a pallet, uh, you can make it a different color. Let's just, I mean, I know you had the wooden pallet, but just maybe make it a, a distinguished color for the back room. And then they can fill up that from that pallet and instead of having to keep going back and forth for boxes i don't know just another suggestion maybe maybe i'm just thinking too hard on that i don't know we could put pallets right here since i have this stair put pallets down the middle you can still get to everything just a thought bye Here, let's just do all that. I can refill that. I'm sure one of these guys are going to come back with a box. No, they still got plenty of room to do that. Okay. So let's open up the store again. And now we're going to do the e-commerce because we got plenty of product and... I should know where most of it is now. Uh, we got all the freezer stuff, most of it out. Two, four, six, eight. Two, four, six, eight. We got two, four, five left to do. So maybe we add another freezer somewhere. I don't know where we're going to add two more freezers. I guess we could add two more freezers outside. Why not? You guys stand right there? Okay. Don't mind if I do. Yep, just gonna put a freezer right there. <laughs> Next. Well, actually, I could put it right next to that. I know you guys love my outdoor storage. Outdoor storage. Get your product there. And I can put one more there, and we have every single freezer product out on the floor. I need, <laughs> we're going to get rid of that, bring that down here. Actually, that's the same product as this one. Why do I have more of those? I don't know. Get rid of it. Get rid of it. We don't need more than we already have. We just need one of each. Okay. I need chicken. We need four, I, yeah, it's only one box, so we got to do four. Uh, well, technically five, because we're going to keep one on the bottom, even though I just took it away from the bottom. So that goes here, and then back stock of all the chicken at the top. This is the only freezer product that I deem needs more backstock. Uh, 
Okay, so that's out there. I'm gonna just take this one and fill it up to eight. Oh my God, they're already gone. Like I said, we need more back stock of that product. <laughs> just disappears. And then we don't have this out there. Drumsticks, I don't think we have those out here. I just want to verify. I'm right. sorry, I just threw a box at you. Yeah, it's the Oreos that we have. Uh, pizza. Missing something? We got the SpongeBob. We got that. We got that. We're going blind. Uh, let's see. Where is purple stuff? Pizza. That chicken. Potatoes. SpongeBob. That. That. So that, Spongebob, we just put that outside, go there, stuffed, drumsticks are outside, that, that, Oreos, pizza's outside, things are out there, okay, freezer's done, complete, I forgot to pause, ah, oh, man, I forgot to pause it to be um, open 24 hours, crap, oh well. Okay, the lights are going. I'm going to keep the lights off. It's only like 60 more seconds before it hits 9 o'clock on the game. And then we'll just start the next day. And somebody remember to hit F5. So that way we can keep it open 24 hours. I hate nighttime. I hate nighttime. Seventy-one customers. That's all we had. Open the store. Let's wait for them to show up, and then we'll press F five. And pause. There we go. 24 hours, commence! Okay, now we go to E online. Slice spread. Assuming that's going to be this one right here. Nope. Panini pasta, panini pasta. Lasagna. Uh, 
lasagna. Mountain Dew six pack, Twinkies, toothpaste. The toothpaste is right here. Twinkies is on the end cap. Yeah, Swiss rolls. Accidentally grabbed the wrong one. Mountain Dew six pack. Need two of them. Don dish soap, lemon. Voodoo Ranger, King Arthur Premium Flower, Rotini Pasta, Rotini Pasta is in the other aisle. Premium Flower is behind us, King Arthur, and then Stouffer's Lasagna. Where is that at? Gotta be an end cap item. Unless they put it in uh, one of my other aisles that should not be belonging in. I mean, we got a bunch of products out here that are not stiffers. Okay. Lasagna, lasagna, where are you, lasagna? Oh, it might be in a refrigerator section. Might be that. Or freezer. Hello? There it goes. There it is. Cool. Next. Pepsi. So many people. Oh, I clicked on the product. Alice in Wonderland. OxyClean stain remover. No. Why do I think it was that one? Windex. Might be in the other aisle. it is ice cream sandwiches it's oreo twinkies we need another twinkie michelob ultra that's alcohol michelob ultra gotta be this one right here and all done Hundred and twenty five dollar order. That should be fun. Dark roast. That's gonna be coffee. Maybe. Oh, it's Pete. It's Pete's, I thought. Okay. All purpose cleaner. In Valley Ranch. Ranch, 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 ranch. Hello, ranch. Oh, it's a dip. I don't know. Domino sugar we know is back here. Also on an end cap. Uh, Domino sugar, which also that's actually the one that's on the end cap. Dish soap lemon. You guys need to refill that. Chicken nuggets, fire roasted vegetable pizza, okay. I, I don't know what this one is. It's a liquor. Q 
Z. There it is. Okay. Craft mayo. So mayo is down this aisle. Lay's smashed burger. Fresh mozzarella. It's got toilet paper. Mozzarella. And I'm going to grab all this stuff first. Uh, it is chicken nuggets, ice cream sandwiches, Oreo, Lay's, Wonka gift box, vegetable pizza, that might be the outside one. This one. No? Fire roasted vegetable pizza. Guess it might be in the refrigerated section? I don't know. I, I don't remember seeing that at all. Oh, okay. It's this one. I didn't know this was pizza. Houghton's Top Smash Burger. Burger, 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 burger. Fresh mozzarella should be in this section. There it is. In Valley Ranch dip. I haven't been able to find that yet. Oh, there it is. Right there. And then Smash Burger. There it is. Perfect. We got it all. I thought for sure I wasn't going to get that. So now we know some, where some more items are at. Rum, hand soap, vanilla whiskey. Crown Royal and hand soap. Pepperoni pizza, pepperoni pizza, Sour Patch Kids. Sour Patch Kids are in the back. Nope, nope, nope. I do not. Uh, no, there should be in the front aisle then. Pepperoni. Pizza. Right next to it. Sugar in the raw. Pure sugar cane. Huh? I'm confused. An end cap item. Never heard of sugar and raw. Unless it says. No. Yep, there it is. Okay, sliced cheddar, sargento, breakfast sausage, whole chicken. Do we have any chicken out here? Nope, no chicken. Unless it's over here. Another type of chicken. Well, apparently it's not marking it for me, so I think I got one right. Mountain Dew. Not the six pack though. Coca Cola six pack though. Fresh mozzarella. Okay, so chicken leg is definitely not it. Ground beef. Oh, 
Alexa, stop alarm. It's already been an hour. That's crazy. This is your one hour timer wake up call. Whole chicken, whole chicken. That's ham, that's bacon, chicken, where's chicken? Chicken? Can't be you, can it? No, it's chicken leg, I knew that was chicken leg. Slice cheddar, slice cheddar, slice cheddar, Sargento. Cool. Now we just need the chicken. I will restock it for you guys. Just to take one. No! Okay. I thought I got rid of the box that I just did. I'm like, no! <laughs> I went to the wrong place. Okay, what's the next online order? I'm not doing 156 one. We're going to do $15.
Snow White book. Look at that. Super easy, as long as we have it in stock. So, lady, if you're watching, it's basically like Instacart. I'm just packaging foods or cat food and Pepperidge Farm goldfish. That should be back here. Yep. And then cookies. There we go. And then we ship it off. Okay, I already know where the Bisquick is at. Dishwasher tablets. Are we out of the tablets? I oh, know, those are over here. Chocolate powder. Red cat wine. Local hive, honey, kind of extra spring water. Which one is spring water? That one. Uh, Eggo waffles. Did you just take my Eggo waffles, sir? No, he's good. Uh, Heineken, sliced cheddar. We got the Sargento, right? Got the last one. Lucky. Hard boiled eggs, this one. Then we go, uh, it's the original. Wouldn't that be the original? No. I don't know what Heineken original looks like. Anybody, anybody, anybody? Corona Extra. Let's make a little ultra. Turtle. Turtle, turtle, turtle. And soap. Oh, yeah. The Heineken uh, original could be up in the refrigerated section. Right here. Got it. And. Got it. That's what it is. Triple cheddar cheese. Well, we get the cat food first. Premium flour, Doritos. Smashed burger. I'm just going off the ones that I've done previously and try to get those first. Diet Coca-Cola. Cream cheese. Have you ever figured out what that London fog tea is? Can't remember if we did or not. Okay, they want a good amount of books. So they want that book, Wizard of Oz. Gotta get it before everybody takes it. Free relays, purified water, Aquafina, uh, Dr. Pepper, Michelob Ultra, that's in the back, Heineken Original, which was this one, no. Nope. Breakfast sausage, that is this one. Hard boiled egg, triple cheddar cheese. And that is by Kraft. Okay. 
Premium flower, OxyClean stain remover. That should be down here. Maybe not. One of these, or one of these. Uh, it's probably the ones that we're out of. Yeah. Okay, Michelob Ultra. Hmm. I don't know about that one. Oh yeah, OxyClean's right there. Duh. We're out of that. Need a reef stock, guys. Need a reef stock. And then the flower. That would be King Arthur. So we will go get the OxyClean stain removers. Bottom shelf, maybe? There it is. Where I grabbed it. There we go. Michelob Ultra. What does Michelob Ultra look like? Oh. I thought it was the extra. I thought it was the extra. That's why I didn't pick up on it. Uh. I don't know what Harney and Sons London Fog Tea is. Oh, yeah, I do know it. It says tea. It's this one. I don't know why I keep getting... It should just put tea on there. It, we don't need a specific name. And last order. So far on online shopping. Honey Nut Cheerios. Yay! Imperial IPA, Voodoo Ranger, getting lit. Okay, chocolate truffles, butter, and Alex butter. Kibbles and bits. Chocolate truffles should be in this aisle. Smashed burger should be right behind me. Oh, I'm sorry if that was somebody else's. Uh, sushi large. That is definitely not the large. That's the large. Okay. Can't get that. We're going to fill that up. Uh, sliced bread behind us. Cascade complete tablets. Gotta hurry up before somebody takes it. Oh no, that's not it. Cascade, cascade, cascade. Huh. Is it already gone? Am I in the wrong aisle? No, sir. Oh, he took it. He took it. I was too slow. It was an end cap item, but we also have it on a pallet. Yes. Fantastic. Uh, then Cinnamon Toast Crunch. We were already next to it. Potato Puffs. Gone. Let's Yeah, let's just do everything first and then go back to it. Sugar in the Raw should be in next style. Butter, Land of Lakes Butter. Premium Ripe Bread. Let me make sure I got it right. Whole Wheat Flour. Nope. That would be Bob's Red Mill. Pike Place Roast, Starbucks. So we're out of puff, potato puffs, we're out of sushi, 
Uh, veal chop, which would be this right here. Pepperidge Farm goldfish is further back here. And Mountain Dew. So, we just got to get two. Two items. I mean, the freezer just got wiped out. And then sushi large should not be that one. Fish A. They're launching a space X rocket right now. Heck yeah. Are this the same? Yes. Do I have any sushi up here? I don't think so. I can't find it on the bottom unless it's Can't be there. Night Wolf! What up? What up, what up? Yeah, let's get out of here. Go here. Sushi. Oh. I don't have to do any of that. Why do I keep doing that? 165 items purchase. But still, I gotta find the large kind. They are going absolutely ape shit. I know. Final countdown, sir. Oh, it's right in front of me the entire time. Just had different type of packaging. And that would be right here. Come on, video game. Don't freeze on me. You were doing so well. So well. This is my last order. for the program to respond. Please don't crash. Ah, oh, thank you. Now you're pausing again. Stop pausing. So if we're not crashing, now we're not going to pause. Okay, we're gonna move over here. Every time I wanna look up and stock this thing, it just freezes. There we go. Any more orders? Nope, all caught up in orders. That's how you do it, ladies and gentlemen. Now we're going to click the save button since we did finish all those orders. Sit back, relax, and let them do all the work. Okay, so let me tab out real quick. Not tab out. Uh, how do I do this? I'm trying to open up Steam. I'll try while well, still keeping the game open. There we go. 
I'm just trying to write this person back who commented on one of my videos just so I can give them a step-by-step -step on how to figure out where their game folder is and I want to do it myself as well. Okay, so if you go to find it is clicking on the game is right clicking on the game right clicking on the game going to properties properties I can't spell today okay and then go to properties go to the installed files tab click browse and there you have it Sometimes people need help, and the only way I do it is figuring out the different steps. How's it going on down here? I'm going to need to help these guys out. Freezers. Especially chicken. I don't have to put chicken on sale. It, it just sells just like that. And since we have an extra freezer that I put out here for no apparent reason, uh, thinking I needed more space for product, we're just going to fill this up since it goes quick. Look at that. That guy just took four of them. Gone. Never to be seen again. Drum sticks are outside, I do believe. Yep. Let me up. Figure since there's only two in here, let's get rid of it.
Chicken nuggies. Sir? No customers in the back room. Unless it was like last time. Crazy how this stuff goes. It's 48 in this container, and then boom, gone. is fries maybe yep they are fries how are we looking on that cascade palette even better than before. Snuggles running a little bit low. We'll get that filled up. Snuggles right there. How are they doing on toilet paper? That's also a big one. Dude's just taking them all. Uh, completely out of the Angel Soft. Between a number of 1 and 44, we're going to go with Kobe Bryant's number 24. Because why not? Scott's Bounty... We don't have a bounty pallet? Huh. Thought for sure we would have had a bounty pallet. So let's go to skids. And then from there, we're going to go to. Refill all, oh, that way it refills our product and we can actually buy the extra products for that. So we're going to go with Bounty. Five. Chaos. Sir, there's an empty box here. Interesting. I don't know why this box is on the ground. Okay. Thirty two is the max. All 
Uh, we could put it right here. There we go. Get your bounty paper towels here. Are they triples? Damn. That's crazy. They already filled 18 of them. Or it took 18 boxes. I'm trying to keep up with them. <laughs> I mean, they're doing pretty good. Books are out of stock. Let's just say books are out of stock. Chips are not selling too well. So maybe let's see if we put them on sale. See if our little sale items get them. Cannot discount. Why can't I discount? Oh, a discount will make no profit. Okay, so $7. Still so can't do it? $8? Damn, you're paying $8 for chips? That is crazy. Oh, because of the market price. That's why. $9? How, how much are we going to? 12? I think it's just based on that market price where it's not letting me do it. I, I know nobody's going to pay $20. Yeah, we're just going to keep it at the 5 or 6 that I had it at. Because it shows right now profit 182. The other ones are 120. That market price is 646. That's 627. Oh my god. Stupid. Uh, why is my store outside? Um No comment. Okay? No comment. Back wall, gone, gone, always the first tube, besides the alcohol, gone, <laughs> and the books. People walk in here like, sir, do you sell anything? It's their first impression. You're always empty, no books. I mean, we're, they're, they're killing it. They're keeping the refrigerated section stocked besides the eggs. I mean, they're killing it on that part. Freezer lacking because I had to stock it. But it is what it is. I'm just trying to get these chips sold. Yeah, I moved everything outside. They have a pallet mod, so I figured, why not? Why not just uh, do all this outside? Especially uh, freezer units. Not legit, but it's legit in my, my store. And now I'm getting another phone call. The heck? When did that get put there?
Well, that's going to wrap it up for everybody. That's going to do it. And I can't talk for the outro. But if you guys want to enjoy it, drop a like on the video. Subscribe for more content like this one. And I will see you in the next one. I'm out of here.